the question was, do you think someone can win world title in armsling without steroids? Yes, I do. Of course, <laughs> it's hundred percent. We 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 are. I think uh, I have the fortune meeting you, and I have never in my mind have thinking about taking steroids or doing some basically cheating. Let's say how it is, it's cheating. Yeah. But uh, the the way these guys are asking questions is like, can you beat Ciplenko without steroids? And this is this is all, always the question. It's not like world champion because they don't know what world championship is. They're thinking that uh, every time someone pulls in competitions, well, no, that next week will be world championship, and you will see a lot of guys winning without taking steroids. They're always, of course, people are getting busted, and sometimes you can see it from from space, but you can do it. Everyone can do. It. We know we know that we can do it, and the problem with the uh, people who are saying like you cannot do things without steroids is that because they never have done it or they have never seen anyone do it without them. Yeah. I think that's the problem. Uh, th there are different uh, people, different uh, genetics, uh, different abilities. Uh, yeah. uh, the worst is always to compare to yourself uh, that uh, yeah. you think you are training hard. Yeah. You, you, you don't know what the other guys do, but of course, sometimes you can see it, but uh, it's like like Vladislav. You just look at his hands, it's thinking like, oh, he's doing something. He's doing Pro. doping tests all the time. Yeah. I would kill him, if, if would kill him. <laughs> you know? if, I, if I didn't know him, I, yeah. I would say he's a hundred percent user, but... Uh, something. But we know, we, we work together, we, we have strong community against this. Yeah. yeah, so we, we have the fortune of the people like uh, you who influence not doing this stuff, so it, it spreads. And the problem is when guys are saying like, there's no other way to do it. That's, that's a lie. That's a lie. That's, uh, if you, if you want to compete when you're using, just go to competition that are not tested. Because if you're competing and at least one guy there is clean, that's cheating, in my opinion. <laughs> that's 100% that's <not> cheating. <laughs> It is. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, it's uh, doping always a sensitive uh, question, but uh, I believe we should we should uh, talk more about that, and uh, uh, we should uh, uh, really not uh, glorify uh, yeah. athletes who have been uh, catch before and who yeah. have. Uh, uh, or you can see it by banned, of being course, for yeah. a doping yeah. test. Yeah. Yeah. We should do more doping tests. That's another thing that I think we should be doing more. Just making sport clean would make a big difference because sometimes these athletes that, uh, like you said, someone is training really hard and he believes that he's training really hard, he steps on table with someone who uses and it's, it's like day and night, you know, and they get uh, torn apart and their world break and, you know, but um, we're hoping that there are going to be more tests in the future. It should be. It should. It should be, and uh, not only in World Championship and the European Championship. Yeah, uh, in, in it would be great to see in doping WL, test in, in WL, in Slotty Tour, in all big uh, competitions, yeah. in national championships. Yeah. That would be great. That uh, because doping control could show up any time, any place, yeah. and like come and yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. We welcome, we welcome, welcome, welcome to the doping, to doping control. control. <laughs> that would be great. Like, uh, but we have this in Latvia. We had uh, like really small competition, forty people competing, and doping control comes. It and could come any time. Yeah. I said, time, yeah, you, you, it Let's doesn't go. matter. Yeah. And uh, I think the system that we're using now in Worlds should have a lot of work on it. And we will see. I'm hoping for the best. I'm hoping to make this sport cleaner. It would be nicer, I think. Yeah. If we're talking about the uh, World Championship and then other competitions, uh, uh, like uh, Slotted Tour and others, I sometimes uh, don't like too much that uh, some persons, some organizations uh, have started to divide uh, so-called uh, professional arm wrestling professional, and, and yeah, uh, World amateur, Championship amateur. for amateurs. Yeah. So this uh, difference uh, between those, those uh, called professionals, like uh, in a slotted tour, yeah. that's only they, they don't do doping tests. Yeah, they don't do No, I, I'm not saying they're, they're using. using yeah, yeah, no, no. Yeah. Because, again, I really think that the super, super champion of the world, overall champion, can be Oleg Jok without using anything. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, that's, that's my 100% belief. But um, when anyone asks, can you become world champion without doing anything? Of course. But you need hard work, you need dedication, patience, and genetics. Yeah. yeah. 
the, all, all these and maybe more things combined, that's the way yeah. of the champion.